So one of the wonderful gifts when you engage in free writing is you learn the difference between expectation and anticipation. Just think about those two terms for a minute. Expectation versus anticipation. See, we go into the world with so many expectations. Expectations of ourselves, expectations of others, expectations of how we think, sh uh, think uh, things should turn out. And when you have expectations, you're setting yourself up. Because ultimately, at some point, the expectation is not going to be met, and then you're going to feel bummed out, let down, disappointed. Okay? So, and usually when the expectations do get met, then you have more. <laughs> right? Until one day, you don't, they don't get met. Um, whereas anticipation is a quality of the heart. It has the essence of wonder in the middle of it, like a childlike wonder. See, as children, we do not get up with expectations. We get up as children and we're like, wow, I wonder what the day is going to bring. We're full of anticipation. And we're open to all that may unfold through the day. It does not mean that we can't ask that today I would like to have fill in the line. But what it means is that you've put out the asking, but when it doesn't happen, you don't set yourself up for disappointment. See, anticipation goes, here's what I was really looking forward to today at noon. Really, I really wanted this. But when things got changed and it wasn't going to happen, when you're in a place of anticipation, you go, hmm, I really was looking forward to this. It looks like it's not happening. So I wonder where the energy wants to go to. And if I keep myself open like that, then my whole energy being open, my heart being open, my mind being open, amazing other avenues miraculously appear. And ultimately, my needs get met perhaps in a different way because I'm not pushing and I'm not setting up the expectations. So now let's take that illustration between expectation and anticipation and bring it into our frame of mind when we're talking about free writing. What expectations do you bring when people say, I want you to write something? How many people remember the English teacher, right? Holding that ruler over you, going, hmm. Okay. Can we replace all the expectation with just this childlike wonder? Like, oh, I wonder, this is kind of neat. Let's see what happens. And just be full of anticipation, because there's no judgment involved. 